In this video, we will go through the process of mapping of a CAD property to inspection report so that the property value is automatically printed when inspection report is generated. Open the custom Excel report template and add a new sheet and name it as title page. However, it is not mandatory to add a sheet. In this case, we have copied one of the sheet of other standard template just to show this step. Here we can see the part number is a cell value against which we want to write document number value. Document number is a CAD property as shown earlier. Enter the Q dash property name. In this case, we are using K1001. So basically, we want to map K1001 to write that property value in that cell. Save the file. As we have modified the Excel report template by adding a new sheet at the beginning, now we need to update the corresponding INI file. If sheet exists already, then we only need to define the header cell line. In this case, we need to define the page value, sheet name and next sheet ID. Most importantly, we need to define the header cell with the Q dash property name and Excel cell value where this value needs to be printed. Update other pages information accordingly and save the file. From the def folder, open the Q dash HDR configuration file and make sure that K1001 property is mapped to solid edge CAD property document number. Save the file. Close and restart solid edge as these configuration changes needs to be applied to new solid edge session. Open the same drawing launch solid edge inspector and perform ballooning with the create update cn list now let's generate the inspection report by selecting the custom report template we can see the document number value against the part number value this is all because of the property mapping had defined earlier. Thanks for watching.